Welcome to WP Matt. Here in this video, we're going to talk about column sticky options of Elements Kit plugin. Let me show you an example. In this page, when I'm scrolling down, all the content are going up. But look at this section. When I scroll down, the left side of the content remains sticky, but the right side of the content are moving. So this is an example of the column sticky feature. Now the same features we're going to apply in this section. Now open your page with Elementor Page Builder. I need to open the navigator to navigate easily. So this is the main section where this image part and this image and the moving image, this is actually an image. So these three image are inside of this parent section. Here it is. When I open it, I'll find one column. There is a heading, which is this one. And there are two inner section. Now I want to make the inner section sticky. When I scroll up, I want this image to be in this position. So let's go to this inner section, then advanced part, then open this sticky option. From here, select top. Then we'll find some other options. Like I want to make this sticky in 140 pixel. All right. I want to remove the sticky features from this image or from the section when the second inner section will finish, like in this position. When the second inner section will finish, this sticky option will remove. Now go to the second section, then advanced, and there you have to give a CSS ID. Now the ID name is section underscore one. I'll copy it and ease it in the first inner section. Now in here there is an option which is sticky until. In here we need to use that ID. It means when the second inner section will finish, the sticky option won't work. Now let's see the example. You can see this part is sticky right now. And when the second inner section is finished, that sticky section does not work anymore. Now let's make the jumping text sticky. Now click on it, go to advanced, sticky. In here, we just need to select top and we have to make the offset is 140 pixel and the until is going to be that ID. Save it. Now when I scroll up, I can see this both path are sticky. The one last thing I want to make sticky, which is this image. Now click on the image, then go to advanced, then elements get sticky. From here, I'm going to choose the column. And let's see what happens when I choose the column. So I have chosen column and I scroll up, this part becomes sticky at the top of my screen. And the left side of the content is still moving. And if you focus on the left side, there is no this sticky until box. The reason there is no sticky until option is that this sticky feature will automatically remove when the column will finish. For example, I'm scrolling down when the column is finished, you can see this image is no more sticky. But we want to make the image sticky at this point. So click here. I guess this sticky offset is going to be around 280. Now click update. And let's go to the font page and refresh the page. After refreshing the page, when I'm scrolling, you can see the image and the jumping text became sticky. And this image became sticky at this point. If you face any problem using the sticky feature, Feel free to contact us, we'll be glad to help you. Thank you for watching the video.